There's a coyote alert in our neighborhood. That's suburban Chicago, not the hills of Los Angeles or the wilds of Montana. It's right here in Chicagoland. And the funny thing is you're seeing notices put up all over the neighborhoods, people looking for their lost pets. Well, folks, I have bad news for you. Your pets aren't lost, they're lunch. Sales leads can be just as hard to find as those lost pets. So my question for you is, how good are you at prospecting? Are you a lead generation genius? Because that's what our training's meant to do, to turn you into a lead generation genius. There's several areas that you can get good at in, in, uh, in generating leads. One of them is, how do I do electronically, digitally? Do I do a good job on the web? And that's a whole different area of training, you know, social uh, media sites, that sort of thing. Uh, generating leads to your newsletter, easing, that sort of thing. But my question for you is, in another area of digital, how well do you do getting on the radio or television? You know what kind of exposure you get by being on the radio? And you can do that too. We can teach you how to get on the radio and get on TV to generate leads for your business. The other area that's even easier and gets you perceived as a true expert is to get in print. Now I've written for up to two million people a month through trade magazines that I've given columns to. A lot of people are interested in my selling blunders, my funny sales horror stories, and so editors would ask me to write columns for their trade magazines, a lot in the financial services arena, uh, print, uh, advertising specialties, a whole range of places. Hundreds and hundreds of magazines are looking for content, new content, every single month. And if you can learn to write a short article, take a problem, tell a story, show how you solve the problem, and then let people cycle back to you with your tagline. I suggest you pay really close attention to generating leads in ways that your competition aren't. Remember we talked at the very beginning about how you want to pay attention to uh, standing out from the competition? This is one way you'll do it in a big, big way. So how good are you at prospecting? Our job is to get you to be a masterful prospector. The other thing you need to know about prospecting, and this is the number one complaint that I get from sales managers, is you don't get enough referrals from existing buyers. And you don't get enough referrals from relationships you have that aren't even customers of yours. So pay closer attention, build referrals, gain a referral mindset, and start asking people for help. My number one place to ask for referrals, everywhere where I spend money. Bought a car at a Lexus dealership, I'm gonna be doing training for the Lexus dealership. Think about that. Where are you spending money? They at least will give you, it's a warm call at least, they're at least gonna give you a listen about how you, they might be able to buy your products or services. So pay closer attention to referrals, get connected with people, have a referral mindset all the time, and you'll be on your way to being a lead generation genius.